Hello. What is going on, guys? I am Numb Nexus, bringing you guys back some more Pokemon Ultra Sun and Moon. Guys, if you're enjoying, make sure to have a like, subscribe, answer the question of the day, cup a shirt, link is on screen in the description, to the giveaway, yada, yada, yada. We're going to get on with this, though. Not much has changed. Literally nothing. I just stopped recording as of yesterday, and I stayed up all day, too. So it's like I couldn't record all day yesterday, so. Um, some of these parts may go a little late today because I stayed up all day yesterday only to sleep so hard. So I'm like, tomorrow I'm just going to baby steps, you know? It's like when you do an all-nighter and you go to bed at like 1 a.m. And then you wake up at like 2 p.m. I'm like, how? But then maybe it's because I went to bed at 1 a.m. <laughs> how the fuck do you... uh? I got to go around, don't I? Yeah? I gotta go around, don't I? I do. I do gotta go around. I do. Also, I put this new thing on my mic. I don't know if it's gonna sound any different. Um, I haven't really tested it out. This is a test right here. So if there's a difference in the mic quality, you know now because I'm testing it out here. Look at this nigga Nanu done with my shit. <laughs> hey, I got you to thank for this. Ah, the young goose! Thing must have been scared half to death if it's glad to see a wretch like me. What a lot of hassle. A trial goer, huh? Figures. Look, I'm not gonna fight someone who was taken on Team Skull. I'll heal your Pokemon up, so just go. Oh my god, I wasted Hyper Potions! Though, looking around now, it seems like there's fewer Team Skull folks around today than usual, huh? I guess some of, them, some of them might have run off after seeing their boss get beat. Uncle Nanu! And here comes the noise again. Oh, I forgot they were late in. Uh, I'm so sorry. Uh, you must have been so scared, huh? Thanks, Lana. Really, you're something, so you're really something. Uncle, you're a great police officer, aren't you? I really hope that you're keeping a good eye on things here. What else do you stay here for if you're not putting up with the stop team's school shenanigans? The rent's real cheap. Ha ha ha! He's realistic. No one else is crazy enough to stay in as close to Team Skull after all. That's what you say. But well, it's really all for the Pokemon, is it? You could depend on the Aether Foundation to look after the Pokemon that Team Skull hurts. But you stay here to look after them, huh? Come on, Yankees, let's go back to your Aether house. You know what's weird? Aether Foundation is really portrayed as good guys around here. I know they gave that the false hope in Sun and Moon, but in Ultra Sun and Moon, they really seem like it. I'll come back to see you again soon, Uncle. Wait, I'm thirsty. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, no one's asking you to. Alright, shit. Uh, come by the Aether house and you're done, Alola. Pokemon tucked up by in their Pokeballs. Team Skull locked up in their little town. I wonder if either enjoys the experience. So deep! Like, actually, so deep. But we fucking did it. Like, we did the damn thing, man. My squad's healed. So we should be straight. We should be straight here. Why do I feel like something's back there? No, nothing really seems to be back there. Never mind. We're straight, though. We did it. <laughs> Hello, bitch? I beat your squad. You're still here? Is this a punk or is this Team Skull? It's Team Skull. I beat your squad. What are you doing here? Go home! Only one Mon? Go home! And Ekans? Really? She really pulled up here all confident and shit. Like, go home! Actually! I don't care if the thing's like two levels above me. I need to swap Shadow Ball and... Um... And Psych- Shadow Ball and Sludge Bomb- Wow! It lived?! 
Gengar, I feel like you've just been going through a lot lately, my guy. I'm surprised it lived. Also, I got this really cool mug of a Nintendo Game Boy Color mug where it's like Mew at level 50, 55 facing a level 70 Mewtwo and like Pokemon Yellow. And I can tell because the Pokemon Yellow Mewtwo sprite is different from the actual Mewtwo sprite, but yeah. <clears throat> Wait, why is there a random rock here? That's going to kill my OCD. That's why there's a little sticker behind it. Mm. Also, guys, you should be seeing some competitive movesets going out this week. I know you guys saw me do it for Sun and Moon last year, so definitely expect it to be happening for Ultra Sun and Moon. It's good that you guys asked. So a couple people tweeted at me, and I'm like, yeah, I'm going to do that, yeah. Most of the trainers that are also in here are gone as well. Holy fuck, where'd they go? Oh, never mind. So I just saw that later right there. Uh, don't we have to fight Nanu now? He's the kahuna here. I could just fly back because I'd rather not walk. Alright. Yeah, I could just fly back. Look at that. I'm not gonna walk back. You got me fucked up, dude. That's taking the long way, bro. I kind of don't want to do that. I kind of don't want to do that. I kind of don't. Um, but yeah, back to the Aether House it is. I think now after this, we actually face Nanu here. And then the story progression should actually happen, which I'm excited for. Guys, be excited. Ultra Megalopolis episodes are coming. I'm excited. I really am. Because this should be all new content. Or even though a lot of shit that's been happening is new, but... We're home! We brought Youngles with us, too! Look at that orange guru. Huh? What's going on in here? Lana! I'm sorry, I... I can't even make myself smile right now! But why? What happened? Miss Lily... She's gone! They took Lily! Several hours earlier, it's Plumeria's dumbass. I know it's always Plumeria, you brat. Not going to disappear this time, huh? Seems like maybe the tall tales we heard about you were wrong. That was different. Nebby and I were both in trouble. That was the only reason why I used power, so we could both escape with our lives. I know that I'm not capable of much, but I will not make you use that power again. I'm determined not to let that happen. That's why... This time, I'll do whatever I can on my own, even if I do find myself in trouble again. Yo, girl, you know you're in trouble right now, right? Don't spoil little princess. Okay. Leave her be. I like a girl who's not afraid to stand up for herself. And besides, I don't know about calling someone a Pokemon thief just because she wanted to help out a Pokemon when it was suffering. Please, it's no need to hurt anyone else here. I will go with you unwillingly, whatever you want. Oh, doesn't Plumeria not even- I don't think she had bad intentions. I think she took her to toughen her up, didn't she? That Plumeria lady came back as soon as Astrola had left. What? I'm supposed to be a trainer. I've got all these Pokemon with me. Oh, no. Why is he so- He's kind of like a- That's not a happy smile. It's more like a- Holy shit, I fucked up smile. But when it came down to it, Lily had to protect me. Lily, who's not even a trainer to begin with. Now he's mad. Dude, I'm literally how. Did I hear that right? It was Lily who took Cosmog. Gladion, nigga, you eavesdrop. Uh, you know who Lily is? I still couldn't protect them. Then what was the point of me even leaving home in the first place? I can't stand this, this useless feeling. I'll blow it away with everything I've got. Why? Why are you battling me? I know he did this in the original games, but why are you battling me, dog? Take out your frustration on me? Dog? Me? It's not my fault. Alright? I just got back. You should be battling how instead. Not me. Is that gonna one-shot me? Bitch. 
I ain't never gonna stop loving you, bitch. I didn't do anything. Gengar ain't that strong yet. Everybody else is like 40, 42, and it was Gengar at 34. Oh boy, I'm gonna use him a lot more, that poor guy. This thing literally can't touch me. Wait, what the fuck is he? I mean, sure, why not? Um, shit, plays, huh? Like actual plays, huh? Didn't see that coming. <laughs> I actually did it. Like he swapped out. Um. Oh my god! What? Goodness! That's torrent boosted. Does he have a violet on? There's just no way. Does he have a violet on? Cause there's no way. That shit took like 70% of my health. In a torrent boosted stab sparkling Arya didn't. Sorry, I have my phone on. I don't care if it's unprofessional though. I just accidentally had my phone on. Fuck off. Oh my god! That did like half and I have sky high defense. Sure, why not? Getting fucked by Gladion. Jesus Christ, man. They definitely made this game harder. Because I remember in Original Sun and Moon, I didn't struggle with anybody that um, wasn't the Wishy Washy trial because I had Linton or Tora Cat. And I also didn't really ever struggle with. Was that it? The Elite Four was like, it wasn't easy, but it also wasn't hard. It was like in between. I'm trying to think of what else I struggled with. I think it was just a wishy-washy trial, yeah. Oh, that was Z Zoroark. I'm like, nigga, what the fuck? Go back can't do that. But no, I'm thinking it was just a wishy-washy trial. I don't think... I think it was just... I'm trying to think back, guys. Yeah, it was just a wishy-washy trial. Because I didn't struggle with Sophocles or Acerola, and I didn't struggle with Nanu. And I didn't struggle with any of the Kahunas, period. So it really was, straight up, just a wishy-washy trial. That's all that it was. So, in Sun and Moon, where the only one trial gave me problems, versus an Ultra Sun and Moon, where, like, these random boss battles, these random important, like, antagonist battles, will give me struggles and they made this game harder is my point all right i thought they'd make this game easier i would because i saw that in the trailer they showed rotom decks oh my god it's time it's time but no i thought that they would actually make this game harder or easier because in the rotom decks in the trailer they actually showed that um they actually fucking showed that you can replenish your z moves so i'm like oh this game's gonna be easy as shit wrong that was wrong of me. I shouldn't have dragged you into a meaningless battle like that. But I told you both. I told you that Cosmo would bring the Aster to all of Alola. I have to get it back from them. We'll leave from the ferry terminal. You're coming with me whether you like it or not. So the only question is, are you ready to come now or not? You just kind of beat my ass, dog. So I don't know if I'm... Yes, I'm ready. <laughs> Good. Then let's go. Look at Oranguru like, Guru, Oranguru. Oh, don't I face Nanu here before I leave? I should. <clears throat> so we're waiting for how? We should wait. Yeah, I guess so. He's a pretty interesting kid, I'll give you that. Growing up in the Great Kahuna's shadow and still trying to stand up to Hala as equal? Not just that, but trying to become even better than Hala too? He's literally Naruto! I love Hal so much. How was me, dude? Top, top two rivals for me, dog. I couldn't do it. 
I love Nanu so much too. Top five characters in this game. Officer Nanu. If only Team Skull. Wait, what I if only Team Skull could just keep themselves in their troubles to power. Why do you have to make all this fuss, huh? You there, boy. I'm an island kahuna, you know. Battle against me. It'll be a good experience for you if you're hoping to master the island challenge. Sure. Don't take it too serious now. Nigga, it's an important match. Nanu the goat. I remember Nanu's uh, Persian catching me off guard. That Persian had a stacked ass. Wait, I'm immediately recovering. My squad's immediately healed up without a word. When? What? I'm not going to complain, but when? <laughs> I still think that this Kahuna theme is like way too upbeat and happy for such an important boss battle. But I don't know, you know? I don't really know. It's just it's, it's interesting because it's like it's a it's such an important boss battle. But I feel like Sparkling Aria would do here more. I know one is super effective, but it's some stab and torrent boosting. But no, I still feel like I like the Kahuna theme. I do. I just think it doesn't really fit the moment. You know what I mean? Like I love the theme. I think it's great. But like for it to be an important Kahuna battle, I don't I don't think it fits. I fuck with the theme, bro. I fuck with the theme. Alright, let's go ahead and heal up here. Because I got Hyper Potions for days. Are we straight? We're straight. EQ. Don't like 2 k Don't randomly 2 a ko me, dude. Everything in this game is a ra crit. No way! I'm two levels below you. They made this game harder. I don't want to hear it. There's just no way that this could do a KO me. I'm going to get blown back in the Elite Four. What do I do? Earthquake shits on my team. I know I have Delmize, but he's a dark type. All I could do is hope that I'm faster. I'm not. I'm dead. What the fuck, dude? I'm so tired of these random 2 KOs in this game. They made this game harder, right? Like, straight up, the random 2 KOs is insane. Alright, I should live one move. I should straight up live one move. Alright, he's just randomly raising my attack. Come on, come on, come on. Well trained Delmize! Dog, these random 2 KO Pokemon in every Kahuna match, I'm so over it. Um I know Persian has that doesn't Persian have that ability that actually makes it towards defense is higher? Like fur coat, right? It has fur. Is, is that just a fur for a move or a fur for ability? It should also have fur coat. It does have fur coat. Okay. That's what made this thing annoying. I got a sm shell smash here, bro. Because I know he has a dark and EMZ. And he goes for like dark and Oh my god. No way. Can I at least out I should be able to outspeed. Which is higher? 90? Is Dragon Pulse also 90? 85. So flamethrower will do more here. He still outspeeds? Yo, Turnator Dog, I know you're slow, but that even still. No, what am I talking about still outspeeds? Persian's got like 115 speed. Wait, Alolan Persian doesn't change, right? No, it doesn't. I'm stupid. 
I thought Alolan Persian had the Mega Garchomp treatment where they just lowered this nigga's speed. That's not the case at all, actually. Okay, so Dark Types kind of fuck my team until I get that Kamo. Let's body Sam. Oh my god! This is animation so cool. Because they're throwing a black hole. Look at that, Amaterasu. No, it's like Kakashi's uh, teleport. Same with Obito's teleport. Dude, I'm not doing jack shit for damage. Like, I'm just getting fucked. I'm not surprised that my Snorlax not doing much. He's level 35. Okay. So I got my queen back. I should be straight. I'm gonna go for disarming voice. Good. Tired of the random two KO moves. Feel my wrath, dude. Feel this wrath. Oh, Nanu. No, but I did not struggle with none like this in Sun and Moon. I think even the levels are lower, too. Somebody actually mentioned it. I forget who, but somebody mentioned it in my comment section yesterday. Where they were all like, they changed the level jump. Where the level jump actually starts at Pony Canyon. Fast Pony Canyon. But in this game, it starts at the beginning of Island 3. That's why, that's where they made it harder. Because the level jump is, fat, is, is sooner. That makes you have to train more. And they actually made it to where the Mons have perfect IVs. Like, if you didn't know, they have perfect IVs. Every important boss battle has perfect IVs in this game. I don't know about perfect EVs, but I do know they have perfect IVs. So. That's something. Shit, Nanu. He's gonna smirk as he smirk. Ah! <laughs> I feel so uncomfortable. That is tough. <laughs> Ah, he's still laughing like that too, Nanu. He's I, I love Nanu. He's easy top five characters from this game, but still. Oh my god. Well, shoot. Of course, I already knew that you had the heart and strength to storm Team Skull's stronghold, but I didn't know you were this good. And your Pokemon worked real hard for you. Let me fix your team up for you. <laughs> it's like he broke. Nanu broke. Here, this is yours. Oh, the Dark and EMZ. I just got the Dark and EMZ. Uh, easy one of the coolest Z move animations. It's a black hole, dog. Also, my hand's kind of asleep, so it's weird. My left hand. It's weird because I accidentally cut myself with my, uh, what is it? With something sharp the other day on my thumb. So I got a big gash that's like recovered now. I'm in the nine tailed fox today, so it recovered fast. But now it's like my left hand is numb now. It's like my left hand's been going through a lot this week. If you want to use a deep, dark type Z power, you better do it like this. Oh, show us now. Go ahead, show us. <laughs> what the? What the fuck? I love him so much. He's so serious and like weird at the same time. I love characters like that. There, congratulations or whatever. You officially finished the Ula Ula Trials. We're done with Island 3. You've got somewhere else to be, don't you? Trying to destroy the whole place. Oh, and you, boy, Gladion. Tell me. If you're really trying to get stronger, as you say, then what are you depending on Team Skull for? You know, I used to think that day one in Sun and Moon. Lana! Don't you dare say a word about this being fun. If I'd been stronger. Oh, how so serious? If I'd been the kind of trainer who could seize victory like Toracat wants to, nigga, you still have a Toracat? Then Lily wouldn't have. That's why you lost. You still have a Toracat, dog. What are you doing? I'm ready to do whatever it takes now. Did you see that serious expression he had on his face? They really meant it in all the trailers and posters. How be more serious? But where was Lily taken? It couldn't be Po Town. Lana was there the whole time. Hmm. So you're not quite as dumb as you are naive. It'll be Aether Paradise. Oh, guys. Big climactic story coming. Aether Paradise. We're already here. 
just randomly. I appreciate there was no black cutscene. I appreciate that. Is it Paradise's Harbor? We made it this far without running into trouble. But I don't like how quiet it is. You two, stay alert. But why would Lily be here, Ava Paradise? She just will be. Ah, this guy. <laughs> Fine. So what are we going to do? Should we look around for her? I guess we take the elevator. You guess? And we're following this guy. He doesn't have any plan. Let's do it. They're already gone. I, know th I think we go this way. I'm pretty sure we go this way. And some matches are just inevitable. Intrude a spot, I'll fight with all I have to wipe you out. Remember when these guys are fake as shit? Give me those fake smiles and everything? Aether Paradise theme, battle theme is lit! This shit is he, man. Alolan Dugtrio? Don't be another uh, insane level jump. Watch. 42? 40. Okay. Dude, this sucks because, like, Gengar can't do anything at all. I'm gonna go out to this anyway. I, it, it hopes that he doesn't go for, like, Iron Head and he just gets Earthquake. He went for Dig. Wait, this thing should outspeed me because Doug Geo is, like, really fast. There we go. I keep forgetting that the Alola Mons really don't have any, like, stat changes. They're just the same. Uh, they just work differently because different typing, different moves. Chums don't need rollout, boy. We're good. Two cannon. I just got it to Bijou. Which, again, if anybody gets that nickname reference, you are a lord. I'm not going to say where, but if you get it, you're a lord. All right, let's do this, bitch. Let's just go ahead and go for Zing Zap. Oh, he lived. Doesn't two cannon like randomly have like decent HP? It's decent HP or decent defense. Or Togedemaru just sucks. I'm looking up right now. I'm curious. Two cannon has yeah, it's decent HP. It's base eighty. Isn't Togedemaru uh? Togemaru's got like 98 attack. That's surprisingly and 96 speed. Yeah, for, a, for a steel type, its defense is shit. 63 for a steel type? It's fucking pathetic. Steel types are known to be bulky, naturally or not. Naturally or just straight up bulky, that's what they're known for. Even if they don't have like juiced up defenses, uh, they're known for that shit. I have to fight this bitch anyway. I can't do anything about that. But yeah, steel types are known for being bulky. Just look at. Pokemon like like Metagross for example I know he's really fast and really strong but he's also really bulky because that seal typing uses this so much and his HP and defense actually isn't that bad dude the Aether Paradise Girls snacks like if I made a top 10 they'd be in it I'll make a top 10 guys if you want to see top 10 baddest girls from Ultra Sun and Moon top 10 because they're a top 5 for Sun and Moon Definitely let your boy know. I will make it. Oh, what was that? Mud bomb? Mud shot? I'm mad as shit that you can hit that with me now. I should live this though. I'm just mad as shit you can land that now on Gengar. I'm like, come on, man. Gengar doesn't deserve this. Gengar doesn't deserve this, dog. He deserves his rightful spot of, you know, his rightful spot of, you know, being the goat again. Okay, I speed Lurantis. The only question is, I know I'm like three levels lower, but I'm still a fucking Gengar. Is this one shot? Doesn't Lurantis have decent natural bulk? It lived that. I feel like it only lived because I'm lower leveled. Gengar, no, I play with my Gengar so like suicidal. Like, 
I just keep using him till he dishes out damage. But the Lorenzo is dead. So he did get the knockout. Atta boy, Gengar. Dude, she's so cute. Like, straight up, she's so fine. Like, I don't care what anybody says. The Ace of Paradise girls are gorgeous. Only so many revives I can actually use. I just want Gengar to get more stronger, you know, until we get the Poi Paul. You know, it's going to blow your mind, guys. Poi Paul being for the UB adhesive. Purple. It's kind of like resembling like a little chibi baby Pokemon. So it's like, it's supposed to signify that, you know, it's a baby saying purple. Poi Paul. You know what I mean? That's what it's supposed to signify. So, sometimes it'd be like that. Parasect? Nigga, who gave you guys your mons? And why do they all have Gen 1 mons? That's out of the Lorantis and Tucanon. It's like a combination of Gen 1 mons and Gen 7 mons. Interesting, huh? I'm so excited for Gen 8 though, guys. I know this game just came out like a week ago. Almost about a week ago. But I'm so excited for Gen 8. I'm so excited. Pin Missile? Why would I need Pin Missile? Why would Magnet Rise actually be the GOAT? Do I need Pin Missile? Sure, why not? Actually, I don't need Magnet Rise. I know it's quad on me, but let's just put in pin missile for the shits and gigs, you know what I mean? For the shits and gigs. Every time I see, you know, a, every time I see, like, an electric type learning pin missile, I give it to it, like Jolteon. I always give Jolteon pin missile, just, just cause, of psychic types, you know what I mean? And I resist psychic types, so, oh, oh, Gengar's got, like, no bolt. Special defense is not too bad though, but it's just, I probably should have not done that and just gone out into this, but 45, by the way, strongest Mon, by the way, highest level, by the way, my Togedomaru. People were tweeting me the other day saying if I'd love fan art. Yes. Don't ever ask if I'd love fan art, guys. Just always assume that I'd love fan art. Always. I love fan art. I love that shit. Pseudo Wudo. I'm gonna go out into my pre marina here. I love that shit. I love that shit, bro. Alright, let's just go ahead. Sparkling Arya and do some work. That's just one shot, right? Good, he's not sturdy. Thank God. Thank the heavens. That he's not sturdy. Thank the heavens, dog. Two on 45. Oh, that's just slam? Never mind. I thought it was heavy slam. I don't want slam. I actually don't want slam at all. Alright, let's go ahead and basically revive this Gengar again. He's a trooper, right? This Gengar's a trooper. Do they have like any baby potions that don't heal much? Oh, when it consumed an extremely bitter medicine. So it's basically gonna make your Pokemon hate you or some shit. Let's just do this. And one anyway. Mm. Oh, is there just where we go to no don't tell me I wasted my time we don't actually oh we do okay okay okay. I was like what the fuck did I waste my time hmm <laughs> just like I thought huh what were you doing there looks like outsiders can't use the main elevator to reach the lower levels I was afraid this might happen but still what a pain we don't have any choice we'll have to go up he was so dramatic about it. Holy shit. A. Ooh. 
What? Mmm. Mmm. What? What? Hit a nigga lick. Hit a nigga spit. Hit that nigga clip. What? Hit a nigga spit. Hit a nigga clip. Yeah. Yo, you could really spit some shit on this. No, I Faba am the eighth urban chief. The only one in the world. I'm irreplaceable. And here you come back uninvited. Like you don't know why. You people should know everything that happens in the Aether Foundation. Isn't that right, high and mighty branch chief? Hee hee hee. Look at you. Living out in the world hasn't been kind, has it? Nobody likes Faba, by the way. But I'm still not telling you anything. And you people should understand why, Gladion. Hey, Lana. You know why being a trainer is so great? Because when you're battling, it doesn't matter if you're a kid or an adult. Everyone's equal in Pokemon. Oh, he's right. You could even be battling a trash trainer, and they could still win because this game's RNG. Holy shit. Oh, is that right? Is that what you think? So you wish to battle me, Branchy Faba, the man who was told Aether Pirates' last line of defense is to battle a mere child? As you will. Bitch, run my fade. Run my fade, dog. What's he got here? A hypno? Oh, that's right. All he has, nigga, last line of defense, and all you have is a hypno. Yeet! Isn't it like level forty-eight? Some highest level? It's just forty-three. Okay, so hypno actually has really good special defense, and he's got decent bulk. So I feel like he'll live this, and body was a psychic. Oh, he just disabled me. Okay, I know for a fact Sludge Bomb is not killing from that range. Let's just swap what we can. Let's just swap. Let's just swap what we can. Hypnosis. Oh, come on! Did he actually see that coming, or like what? Uh, do I have any full heals? Anything? I do. Nightmare? Ah, you would have thunk. You would have thunk, bitch. Nigga, how? I know he outspeeds, but he lands it again? Can you stop doing this? How is he landing a base 50 accuracy move? Is it 50 or 60? It's one of the two. I know he's in a nightmare here. He's psychic this time. Okay. Alright. Can I... Shadow Ball? N three times? How? How is he not missing? Straight up. I guess I'll just go to chums. There's just no way he's giving me problems like this. There's just no way. Like, I'm genuinely shook. Four? What is going on? I don't understand this. That's my boy. Out of boy, chums. My boy, and now he misses after landing four in a row. Fifth time is a charm, right? Holy shit, man! Jesus on wheels. Fuck off, Faba. There's just no way. He's so shocked that he lost. Nigga, you only have a hypno. What do you mean, how could this be? You have a hypno, bro. You have a hypno. Look at you, Lana. And Faba is real strong. He has a hypno. So, as I said, Faba, you old people should know what I'm here for. 
Indeed. The world truly hasn't been kind to you, has it? Look how hard it has made you. Yeah, because you used to be a pretty little rich boy. If you're looking for Cosmog, I suppose it might be downstairs. Downstairs? Oh yeah, Miss Wick did say that there was another level farther down, didn't she? What do you do down there? He's lying. Experiments to reach a new world, different from Alola. That's what I've been told, yes. We're in a bit of a hurry, Hababa. A lift would be nice. Why not? This is an act of kindness I can do for you for thinking my position as branch chief. That's what he plays here? He plays us, doesn't he? He plays us here, doesn't he? Are you ready? Yes. Alright, let's go. Yeah, he plays his watch. They're gonna zoom on his face and he's gonna smile. Yep. He plays us here. Everything looks the same. I guess it's only been two years though. Wow, it's like a secret hideout. Don't get too excited, Hal. Though I feel I guess it's better than freezing from fear and nerves. So where do we go now? There are two labs up ahead. I'll check the first lab, Secret Lab A. You two check out Secret Lab B. It's the second lab down the hall. Why don't you get the first one? And why do you know all this? Just focus, Hal. Think you can do that? We can't trust Faba. I'm sure he's already told half the Foundation about all of us. You didn't even answer my question. I know what it's gotta be. Nerves, eh? I reckon that you're more afraid to be here than one of us, huh, Gladion? You know, it's oddly true. Here, Lana, you take this. Potions? Max survives. My dude, stay looking out for me. Lily must be scared right now. Let's buckle down and do this. And that's where we end the episode off, guys. Story is picking up. It is picking up. I'm excited. Guys, if you're enjoying, make sure to leave a like, subscribe. And with that, I'll see you all next time.